for this video, I'm going to show you my camp shooter settings. Um, so for my region, I have fixed region, 640 by 360, because that's the new YouTube dimensions. Um, and for my, uh, like, f some people like full screen, which um, I like too. So that's why I had like I have this video on um how to zoom in with like hyper camera cam studio or any screen recorder and it's called zoom it and uh it's like really good cuz you can zoom really close in or like a little bit in you get to choose and you can also draw on your screen and type on your screen. If you don't have a mic, that would be good for you. So yeah. Um, so I suggest downloading Zoom it if you want to do full screen. But let's move on. Okay, so for options and video options. Um, uh, I usually use the DivX codec if I'm using 640 by 360 but if you're using full screen you can't use the DivX codec because it won't let you it'll say you have to use a different codec so use Cam Studio Lossless codec or um... other code um... or Xvid or there's another good one I forgot what it's called I don't have it here I think it's like something Smith um... but that's a good one too but uh, you don't. It does, when you download Cam Studio, it doesn't come with lossless codec, the Cam Studio lossless codec, or the DivX codec. You have to um, download them, and I'll have a link in the description, which has uh, this link has like it's like a pack, so it has more than one codec. And the reason you should have that is because it has a, like a lot of useful codecs and not only for video but for also audio and there's some media players you get to choose so yeah I'll uh, have that in the description and it has XFID and DivX and uh, I'm not sure if it has Cam Studio Lossless Codec so I'll have another link for that too and I'll have a link for um, Cam Studio the website so um, for the quality, I have 60. For set keyframes every 30 frames, uh, capture frames every 50, and playback rate every 20 frames. Um, you really have to have this as 20, I think, or else it would be like your audio. I think it's this. If you have it like at 30, then your audio will be like off of your video. So. Um, if I go to DivX and go f configure, if you're using DivX, have this at two, it still looks really good. This at four and one pass, and uh, then for uh, Cam Studio, uh, you don't really have to do anything here. So yeah, um, click OK, and um, for my cursor options, I have. Uh, s highlighted circle around my cursor so if you can't see my cursor the light will like guide your eyes towards it so attractive so yeah um so just like that's kind of a given what you should do your options for that anyways um for uh record audio I record from my mi my mic obviously and for um uh like for audio options you go synchronize and click audio goes before my video and make this 10 and for um this I click enable auto pan and what that does is um when you are in like a screen like mine like 640 if you're not doing full screen then when you move your mouse then it'll move around with your mouse unless you're doing something that you don't want your mouse to I mean the screen to move with your mouse then 
you can uncheck that. And this, you can like customize how fast your uh, uh, auto pan speed is. Some people think that mine is like way too fast, which I don't agree. I think 40, maybe a little less, would be good. And uh, program options, I usually have this at minimize program at start. But since I'm doing this video, I didn't check that, but I would suggest to do that. And for, um, uh, yeah, I checked the rest of these, too. And keyboard shortcuts. These were practically, like, shortcuts to, you know, like, start your video, stop your video. As you, s like, s in some of my videos, I go all the way down to the corner where the program is shown and then click stop. But I would suggest to have shortcuts so you don't have to do that at the end of your video. Um, yeah, and that's practically all. And also when you go to fixed region though, um, you should have this drag corners to pan check too if you want to move your uh, screen with your mouse. Yeah, so thanks for watching and please comment on videos I should do.